This is Eric Hyland from Hasfu, and I'm here on set live of the Christmas Snow Trost Moving Pictures with uh, the little action star here, Cameron Ten Naple. Um, what a blessing it's been to watch you on set, your professionalism, your enthusiasm, your joy. Um, just incredibly blessed to watch you, and, and uh, thank you for taking this time to do our interview. So my first question for you today, uh, Cammy, as she likes to be called, um, you know, Tracy called me, Tracy Trost called me, and he told me, I just told Cammy that she got the part. What was it like when you got the word that the part was yours? It's actually really funny because I was over at my friend's house who lives across the street from me, and so um, she actually does acting too, mm -hmm. um, but she does more like theater type stuff. And so my mom, she ran across the street, and she's like, <laughs> she had Tracy on speaker, oh. and, um, and like, my friend, she was like, <laughs> whenever we found out. And so I was just like, whenever she hung up the phone, I just started screaming, because this is like, this was, it's probably like the best, just most wonderful experience that I've ever had. I was blessed to meet your family today, and... It's really interesting to me. I know that you can't really talk about all the parts that are being offered to you, but you've had quite a few that have been sent your way. And I've been very interested to see how selective you and your family are. And I'm, honestly, I, I applaud that. I applaud that in great measure. I think a lot of young actors and actresses make mistakes early on in their careers that I think you're avoiding. Can you talk about that a little bit? It's not like we're avoiding good parts that we just don't want to do, it's, we're being very careful on the parts that we don't really want to take, so <laughs> we want to make sure, I'm a kid, and I just want to stay a kid as long as I can, don't just take those big steps before I need to. What is it like to work with Tracy as the director? He's basically just a really good friend who's giving you direction, it's, He's so he's so nice and he's not too picky about the things. He's he's not at all. He's just he's just an awesome director and I think this is definitely where he should be cuz he's he's very good at his job and it's very professional. There's just a central focus on Lucy and, and her struggles and her, where she's at. Can you talk about Lucy a little bit and what your thoughts are on the character? I think that she's a very it doesn't come off this way, but I think from my perspective, she's a very sensitive character actually and she she's had a rough time going on with her life I mean her mom passed away a few years before and she's just having a tough time moving on but she's doing great at it and I think this is just she's a wonderful person so good it's very blessed to be able to play this character <laughs> and, and what's your favorite scene and, and why is it your favorite scene that you're in my favorite scene would have to be the one whenever we're making the gingerbread houses because I just think it shows a very nice bond between the characters. And it really shows, that's whenever Lucy starts to open up kind of and it shows more of her. Mm -hmm. And so I just thought that that was just a really sweet scene. And I'm not just saying sweet because there's a lot of candy. In it. <laughs> what is the funniest thing that's happened to you on the set? The clothespins. The clothespins that the have clothespins. been sneaking that around. Everybody people. clips to each other. It's have so you been funny. clipped? Oh yeah, I've been clipped two two clips at a time. It's it's funny, and well, but I I'm also a clipper. I clip Are you a clipper? Yes, I Cammy. There's a lot of young actors and actresses out there. A lot of them that are trying to break into the business. You're here. You've made it. You've done it. You're continuing to progress forward with your career. You're getting all kinds of offers. If you had one piece of advice to give them, what would you say to them? Be professional about your choices. Don't pick anything that you get. Don't just, if an offer comes out, don't be too eager about it because you have to know what you're getting yourself into. It's actually a really tough business. Thank you, Hasfu fans, for taking the time to join me and Cameron Ten Naple uh, during this interview for A Christmas Snow. I encourage you to become a fan of Cameron. On Facebook, uh, she does have a fan page, Cameron Ten Naple, and also become a fan of A Christmas Snow and support this film. Uh, again, we appreciate you very much, and Cammie, thank you so much. Thank you.